Welcome to Good Mythical More. Things are not always as they seem in the world of food and pictures. Can we tell what's phony baloney or real baloney? But first, how about a random disturbing fact? All right, I'm up for this. Petting birds turns them on sexually. Oh, really? Yeah. Bird's sexual organs are located directly under the wings on a bird's back? What, what? Yeah. They, oh, yeah. they mate back to back? If you offer your bird full body strokes, you are actually stimulating the production of sexual hormones. Petting down the back or under the wings can lead to a sexually frustrated bird or a bird who perceives you as his mate rather than a companion. Uh-oh. What, well, where, where, what's, what, what? Directly Set. under the wings. I want to know where the bird. Oh. <laughs> where, where's the bird? Oh, well, hello. <laughs> the bird wiener. Uh, it's not a bird wiener. They have a clo. Uh, what is it? Cloaca. Cloacia. What do you call yeah, it? Cloaca. Do, is it? But what about the? Uh, you don't want to touch that. The male and the female both have a, the same thing. I don't know how it works, man. Okay. I mean, it's called the birds and the bees. It seems like it would be like comparable. Can you I pull up a video? I never understood the birds and the bees thing. Cause birds if, mating. But if a, cause if a, um, if a, bee, how to, if a bee stings how a bird. How do birds mate? If, yeah. If a bee stings a bird, does it get pregnant? No. <laughs> well then explain birds and the bees to me. It's a euphemism for just the natural occurrence of things. Have you ever seen a bird sting a bee? I mean. <laughs> no. <laughs> have you ever seen, I can safely say I have Have you ever not. seen a bee sting a bird? How do you know it didn't get pregnant? Did you, were you there? Were you there? <laughs> Birds mate with what is known as a cloacal kiss. Okay, that doesn't sound like Picture fun. these as two cloacas. Okay. That's bird sex right there. I'm glad I'm not a bird. <laughs> that doesn't seem very fun. Man. Seems like you're wringing out a, t a pair of underwear, <laughs> you know? Right. <laughs> which now is, if a bee comes which, along, which stings it pregnant. Incidentally, is what, is what I do after mating. <laughs> Ring out of your underwear. <laughs> well, you, we might need to talk. <laughs> you got to take your underwear All off. right, let's see the first one. Can we tell if this is real food or... Prop food. Prop food. Oh, look at that Phony. bag of apples. Phony, and I'll tell you why after we... It's easy to, it's easy to fake an apple. Yeah. But it's also easy to put real apples in a basket. Real. Phony. These are real. Ha! I'll tell you why in a second. All right. I was going to just make something up <laughs> if I was right. Yeah. So how do you know? Are the cloaca? Well, is how the how cloaca on real? the back? Where is the cloaca? It's not on the back. No, it's between the legs. Well, yeah, but then why stroke in the back? Is what? What sexual organs are on the back? Some other ones. You know, apples got two cloacas. You throw up two apples together. Top and the bottom was going to get pregnant. They do look fake because the. They're leaves. too perfect. Yeah, the leaves. I was going to say the leaves look fake. And those stems in the back going up straight like that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I think these might be fake and y'all just didn't know. All right. I mean, I want to... You're convincing me. Play the video. I want to see somebody come up and take a bite out of it. Yeah, right. Yeah, that's the only way to prove it. Like, what'd you just Google a, pa a, a picture of real apples? If you just Googled a, a picture of apples, those might be fake. He is right about that. I oh, mean, yo, I... You know? You didn't do anything? Didn't do anything. Mm. Mm. Yeah, okay. Okay, well, all right, okay. whatever. I don't know. I think those are fake. This is a farce. Yeah, yeah. Don't rub those two. No, I think this game's still totally intact. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'll proceed. They could all, they could all be fake. <laughs> we have no way of knowing. <laughs> Let's keep going. <laughs> yeah. All How right. about this? Uh, okay, so this is a cake. With, with two like I mean gingerbread troll house type things on it. That's a fake cake. What's the point of a fake cake? Why? Never, why? Ne never goes bad. You can leave it outside on your deck. Ha <laughs> ha! Clue. Yeah. And is no kinda... ants get it. You can't put a real cake on a but, deck. But but why would you want to leave a fake cake out on your deck? Well, why wouldn't you? Think about the neighbors coming over. Have you been to the McLaughlin's house? They got a cake on the deck. Can you eat it? No, but it's there. <laughs> right. I mean, <laughs> I don't know why. I mean, every time you show up, you, every time somebody new shows because up. Because 
These are props. The props. So man. you might need a cake in a in a bakery to look nice. Yeah, but that one's sitting on a deck. Well, I'm not saying this one looks particularly nice per se, but I think it's a pretty nice one. But it is fake. It's it's fake. It's on a Can't deck. Put, put it on a deck. It does look very nice. I take back what I said. It's a, it's yeah. It's a prop. What's a prop? Well, hold on. Why are you taking it back? Because I feel bad. I don't want to say that it looks bad. It looks great. Hold on. Um, did somebody here's relative make it? No, but well, two peas and a pod reefs uh, made it on Etsy, and I would. And oh, it's I beautiful. Feel bad. It's yeah. beautiful. I'm a big fan of that account. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I'm getting you some know, intel in about the apples in the previous round. Oh, okay. Your, your um, piece Emily is, would is like to, to tell you those were. I don't know how to pronounce this, Emily, but Jonagold apples. Jonagold, yeah, they've been Jonagold. I, could, I, could, I was going to say they looked like they had been Jonagold, but I just didn't. It's not a verb, dude. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? What? So, and what? Uh, she said that <laughs> she they're, said her reasoning was they're specific real apples, and nobody is out here making specific apples for eye stock. <laughs> That's true. Oh, I get it. Okay, that that's good, good logic. Jonicled. Jonicled. Okay, you want to see the next one? Yeah. I, I want to get jonicled. Okay, so we've got some fake Cheerios, or all those real Cheerios. Too many bubbles. Why are there so many bubbles? That, that's a dead giveaway. I mean, it's frothy. Fake. It's it's fake because it's frothy. It's fake because the bubbles weren't there. That was a part of the drying and, process. And that spoon is, oh, so fake. Look at that spoon. No, this. I think the spoon is totally real, but the um, no, no, the, no. The Cheerios, I can tell those are off-brand Cheerios. And that bowl, it, that bowl itself also looks like it's fake. And the and the background, that's fake. The fa the background it's on, that's fake. That's not real white. Okay. Yeah, it's all fake. Yeah, it's all fake. Oh, mac and cheese. How could this be fake, my friend? Well, it's on a deck. <laughs> You're right. It's I mean, on a deck. You got, you can't, What's the deal? You can't put mac with and cheese food on, on a, deck. a deck. Fake food. You can't on do that. decks. But I'm sorry to say that I think this is the one exception. They put real mac and cheese on a deck and took a picture of it. That's a rugged. It's a rugged little bowl of mac and cheese. You know, that's like a country chic. What's it called when you? Uh, you talking about type like, of decor where it's like those, sh 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 shabby chic. You're talking about like it's a shabby chip, chic. chip and Joanna. Chip and Joanna. This is Gaines. some Chip and Joanna Gaines mac and cheese yep. on a deck in Waco. Yeah, <laughs> Chip and Joanna. You know, that's a Waco thing, right? Magnolia. There. It's, it's real. That Magnolia Network. They eat that stuff up, man. I love like it. Like mac and cheese with crumbs on it on decks. Yeah, man. People buying subscriptions. They don't eat if they're not on a deck. Right. They'll starve if they're not on a deck. I mean, the splinters that those those people are getting. That's a real bowl. Those are very real spoons. Is and you can't get crust like that in, in Fake Town. Crust? This is real. Crumbs. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're good at this. Uh, are, we, are we both uh, 100%? I'm 100%. I don't know. I you're think that Rhett got the first one wrong. Check yeah. it. You got to work. Your button's not working right, Stevie. It's, it's cutting in and out. I'm sorry. I have a new button. Uh, I will press it harder. Mm -hmm. That's a cool trick, Link. Do that. I am doing it. Holy moly. Have you done that before? Yeah, stretch it. Oh my gosh. That's the coolest shit. Hey, everyone's got to get this shirt now. Oh, the, uh, look at that. Look at that. You're taking the wiener and putting it. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. <laughs> it's magic. It's a regular shirt. Look what you're doing. This is like the opposite of a cloaca kiss. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That's the coolest shirt I've ever seen. Uh, hot dog is a sandwich. Wow. Is it is not only a t-shirt, uh, but it is a podcast. Josh and Nicole, they debate, they swap hot takes on food topics every week, every Wednesday, wherever you get your podcast, a hot dog is a sandwich. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. That's cool, man. We got to make more of those. Man, let's let's see, get I more get... things that we can manipulate like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, that's bread. Now, what's under that paper? Deck? Well, Is that a tablecloth? Now, those are cutting boards. A lot of times you can confuse those as pieces of deck. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's 
Sometimes a cutting board can be mistaken for a piece of deck, but that is just a cutting board. Bread it's on a deck. wood. What There's kind something... of bread is that? Just bread dipped in chocolate? Yeah, that's a, that's a sign. They tr the fake person who made these tried too hard. It was made by a fake person? Yep. Very, well, I, most people who make uh, food that's fake are very superficial. They, they get themselves mixed up in their work. Right. Identity issues. And they're like, who, Method. Who, who am I doing this? I just spent all this time on this bread that nobody can eat. Uh, uh, I've never seen a bread dunked in chocolate like that. Yeah. Is that, how could that even, is that a thing? I actually think the reason that this is on a cutting board is it's a sign to all the other people who make fake stuff out there that, hey guys, these are fake. We put it on a deck, but kind of like, you know, a deck. You know what I'm saying? Right. So this is fake, but very well done. Very, very well that's done. That's very well done. Very convincing, but totally 100% fake, no questions. You know what? You're, you're exactly right. Yeah, it's fake. Ah. It ain't, I've never seen uh, bread dipped in chocolate like that. I've never seen But that. wouldn't it be good? I guess. I, mean, I don't know. Only one way to find out. I don't know. Let's see another one. I like this. Oh, I deviled think, eggs. Well, we got a resolution issue here. Yep, it's low resolution. But that's in the grass. These are very perfect. I've never, I've never seen this either. I've never seen a, Easter eggs. a dyed deviled egg. Dyed and deviled? Oh, but here's the thing about this. So the egg's not dyed, the, if you do the it, hard boy, I didn't even know you could I don't color. think you can do that. Can you, can if you, you color dye a hard an boiled egg? egg? If you open, you peel it, it's still white inside. But then you dye we that. We on this show. We did this? Who is that, God? Fake food, real food thing. What? God? That's carnage. Fake food, real food eggs. Ah, I forgot about it. Okay, we've done it. So it's real. Um, is that what I'm supposed to take from that? Well, that is what Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Uh, now that's on grass. Yeah. That's on grass, man. That's not a deck. That could be steps from a deck. It could though. be right next to a deck. You could step off your deck right onto that fake grass. It is fake. It the is the fake grass is grass. fake. It's definitely fake grass. So but the, that's why. It's, but the but the eggs might got, be real. It's fake grass. Why would why would anything else be real? Fake grass is really catching on. Have you seen? Have you just taken a walk around your neighborhood recently and seen how much fake grass there is? Every every day there's more fake grass. My neighbors got that, and I was thinking this morning, I was like, they've got some really high quality fake grass. That's, oh, it's getting better all the time. It's getting better all the time. All the time. I mean, it's I like when I look out my window, and I, you know, just to see what I can see over there in their yard, I always think about how real the fake grass looks. Yep. yep. Every day it's getting better. Mm -hmm. um, I, was, I, I might get some. Well, you know what? Even the decks are fake now. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. They're synthetic planks. Yeah, I know a guy with a fake deck and fake grass. How long do you think we could play this game? Like eight hours straight? His wife does have implants also. My neighbor? <laughs> <laughs> the guy I know that's got fake grass and a fake deck. Got a fake? His wife got fake rack? Implants, yeah, yeah. You know what? Just try, be, he's just trying to be consistent. It can be done well. Yeah. It can be done really yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. I, I, you know, they're I, getting better every day. I respect all three things. That's well, a right. different good mythical more. <laughs> Technically four. I just wonder what it feels like, you know? Well, the, the deck feels like real wood. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> what do they feel like? I mean, I just want, I do want to know. Have you felt your neighbor's grass? You know what, I haven't. <laughs> you ought to go over there and do it. Okay, what are you saying? Stevie, you ever, have you ever felt implants? This is a good question. <laughs> Let's drop everything. Not to my knowledge. Let's drop everything and hear Stevie's answer if, in detail. But in the moment you feel them, do you know it? Yeah. Yes. I think you would. Well, you think, I don't know from experience. Maybe not, I'm just saying like, that. Maybe not like new new ones. No, I get better every day. I think there's a different consistency in there. That's, it feels it, like you're touching a donut. Is it a donut? <laughs> it's like it's like ah, I think there's a hard donut in there. I think it's. Ah, I, <laughs> uh, I think there's a hard donut in there. I'm gonna have to ask Christy how this can be arranged in like a totally acceptable way, like a clinical way. I just want to feel. Is that to what's see going what they through your feel head? Like. Huh. Not because I want Feels to like feel there's them. There's a hard donut. I don't want to feel them. I just want to see what they feel like. There is a difference, right? You know. 
one's desire, the other's curiosity. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> well, it seems like you can have both. <laughs> desire, you <laughs> one, fill up one hand with desire, the other with curiosity. Yeah. What's the saying? Yeah, right. You can, you can crap on one hand and wish in the other and. Yeah, right. See which one fills up more quickly. One's desire and one's curiosity, and those both sound like stripper names. <laughs> All right, so let's go with another one. Wait, you didn't, didn't tell me. They're real, they're real. Oh, we're still on this? Yeah. 100%. Oh, this is all fake. No this question. is all fake. No question. The grass That's is real. fake. The... Everything's fake except the eggs, which are real. I, yeah, we think they're real. Yeah. And Emily's reasoning is, the description is, a holiday twist on the classic deviled egg with the egg whites dyed in festive colors, perfect for an Easter brunch. I'll buy and that. And she feels as if the only person who would write that and have it be a lie would be Satan himself. Yeah, right. Yeah, because who would go through that trouble, right? Well, well, well. <laughs> oh. Huh? oh, there we go. <laughs> All right. I don't know if you planned that oh, yeah, yeah. or if you found them. <laughs> there it is. All shapes and sizes. <laughs> Or at least just all sizes. Uh, is there a hole in them? No. No, no, no. And not unless you ask for it. <laughs> okay. I think there might be a hole for the nipple. So this is a this is a this is a powdered donut. Those basket. are all different sizes. Almost like they tried too hard to make them look like they weren't uniform. Again, the people who make this fake looks stuff like try stock. so hard. They're like, oh, we gotta do all the holes, different sizes. But the guy who's making the donuts at the donut shop is very like, consistent. They gotta be the same. They gotta be the same. You gotta put yourself in the shoes of the donut maker. And if you did that, we would be able to tell, we wouldn't be able to tell these are fake. It's like fake. reverse, reverse psychology. Yeah, you gotta go in, then you gotta go out. Yeah, you're right, Rhett. Thanks for thanks for telling me. These are these are fake. You're right. Yeah. You're right, fake. Rhett. You're yeah. exactly right. We you could do this for eight hours. so hard, it becomes too obvious. Okay, mm -hmm. you're speaking specifically to Creative Kitchen Shop. Yeah, y'all, listen. Y'all want a consult session with me? I'll do it for free. 20 minutes for free. Beyond that, it's $9 a minute. I could be blindfolded. He'll I be there, be, blindfolded. I can, no, I, no, <laughs> I ain't talking about that, man. Oh, oh. I, could go, <laughs> I could be led into a room blindfolded, hands first. Yeah. And then I could be led back out. Put, I could never take the blindfold off. Put anything in this man's hand and he'll tell you immediately if it's real or fake. Oh, you're talking about touching the... Right. Yeah, yeah. You won't even know whose it is. I don't need to. Don't even need to know. That's not the question. Okay. Who are you, like, talking to right now? I think he's like, convincing himself. Yeah. This is the conversation he'll have with his wife. Uh, okay. Right. Listen, I'm going to be blindfolded. <laughs> <laughs> they'll lead me in. Hands they'll first. They'll lead me out. I'll never, I'll never meet a woman. Just interested in how it feels. Is there a dummy? I don't think so. Is there like a? Because then, if the dummy is also fake, then you don't get the real experience. <laughs> okay, yeah. Part of it has to be real. The person part <laughs> has to be real. It's got to be able to run from me. But it could be a cadaver. <laughs> That's the answer. That's definitely how this is gonna go down. It's like you contact your local coroner. Oh gosh. I'll be blindfolded. He's really interested in what implants feel like. Okay, he, so but this, he's only gotten approval to do it with a dead person. So this that's wrong, but um uh it all comes yeah, down to now this. Now you wanna change the subject. Heated competition. I crossed the line. Yeah, you crossed the I line. I crossed the line when I brought the coroner into it. Ants on uh, a log. I, that's real. You can't fake that. You can't fake that. You can't. You can't fake ants on a log. <laughs> you can't fake it. And who would want to, right? It actually seems pretty easy to fake. The raisins are too big, <laughs> but that's why I think it's real. Because oh, if you were faking it, you would have gotten the raisins right. This was just an unexpectedly big raisin day. How do you make those fake raisins? <laughs> you think this is fake? I think it's. I think it's real. It's uh, real. I don't think this can be faked. Yeah, you can't fake it. <laughs> okay, you're gonna go out on a tie then. You're both in agreement that this it, is real? No, well you change yours because that's real. Oh, it's real. You can't make peanut butter look like that. It's fake. Ah, you blew it. You really blew it. How, how did they I wanna it? meet that person, whoever made that. 
Who's that? Fake food for you. Fake food for you. Fake food for you is operating on another level. That's, that is amazing. In fact, I think they may have used real, real peanut butter to make their fake peanut butter. All right. Peace out. Ketchup is a smoothie. Yeah, I put ice in my cereal, so what? That makes no sense. A hot dog is a sandwich. A hot dog is a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> what?